welcome back to my channel where I'm realizing my greatest financial potential. If you like to see cash stuffing, debt tracking, debt free journey videos, then you have stopped at the right place and are the right channel. So take a look around the channel and if you see anything that you do like, don't forget to smash that thumbs up button, leave a comment and subscribe and also don't forget to share. So let's just jump straight into July's budget. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Okay, so we're jumping straight into the budget. So my income for July is expected to be from my first job, 1453.84. And then from my second job, this should be total. Uh, my total income for the month should be 2,729.39p. Then we have my rent, which is the usual 362.50. My utilities this month is actually going to go down. Um, food remains the same. And my phone bill which gives us a grand total of 527.50. So these are my essentials that I cannot live without. And for those of you that have been with me for a while, you're going to realize that my debt section has gotten significantly um, smaller. So we'll talk about that as we go along. Okay guys, so I've brought you in a little bit a little bit closer so as you can see that my the number of debts that i have have shrunken and that's because i've combined all of my credit card debt that i had into one loan where i will pay overall less in interest because the amount that i was wasting in interest i was like that does not make any sense so while my debt um has will remain the same as it was from last month the amount that i pay in interest has gone down and it will continue to go down which will allow me to reach my saving goals a bit faster so the current balance on this loan is nine thousand four ninety and fifty eight p with a payment of three 317.04 and the interest charged here will be one where my principal payment the goal is to have my debt done by half by the end of this year and i'm really working hard on it um, but for me one of my goals is to also meet my um, emergency funds target that i have um, because with what happened last year, I don't want to be caught with my pants down again. So while I won't be focusing as much on my debt as I was um, in the prior months, that's because I'm really trying to build my emergency funds. And as soon as that has reached its target, then it will be go time on the debt where it might not be the end of this year that I have it down to half, but by the end of 2022 i should be almost finishing paying off my debt because a girl is going to be hustling and hustling hard anyway the new loan is now seven thousand five hundred and the minimum payment for that is one nine to five the minimum payments of my credit cards all together combined um let me just go back real quick was 349 pounds so i'm saving overall minus 19509 so that's a difference of 153 pounds in 91p that i'm saving um by combining all of my credit card debt together so anyway i'm estimating that the interest for this should be 80 and then Suke 
um, payments, 150, and there's no interest here, and this is 150. C is 180, and the payment for this is 6 to 4 pounds and 7 to 3p, and the interest is 17 for to 6. Every time I pick up this camera, someone is at the door. I'll be right back. <laughs> Sorry about that. I'm back now, and where did we leave off? So, telephone. 1000 No, I do have the money to pay off my telephone um, bill, but um, by the tape, by the time of this video, I did not pay it off. So I'm still um, adding it into this month's budget. Um, by the end of August, this one will be no more. I'll just pay it off. I was just um, paying it as is because there's no interest. So I wasn't losing anything. Um, but I think just having it on my overall debt standing, um, I'm really trying to get under 20000 And um, by making this payment, I'll be a lot closer to um, getting my debts under twenty k. So all of this total up is going to be 21789 and 38p. My minimum payments, 762 and my interest that I will be paying and money that will go to my principal payments is 522 pounds and 57 cents. So as I said, guys, I'm not going to be going as hard on my debts as I was going in the for six months of the year um, because I do want to build up my emergency fund. So that's something that you will be seeing from me a bit more, um, some more cash stuff in um, videos. And once I hit that emergency fund target, it's going to be go time on my debt. So my ISA gets 100 pounds and this gets 10 and then this gets 10. So these are just automatic savings that I have um, at the bank because I'm doing most of my, um, I have most of my savings in cash. Well, yeah, no, not in cash, in investments, sorry. So this is going to be 120. Wow, my brain was a little bit slow there. Gym membership, 21.99. Apple is two forty nine and Amazon is eight ninety nine. I'm just gonna add that up. Thirty three pounds and forty seven p. And crypto will get one hundred. Even though we might be in a bear market. I'm still buying. One day I'll get rich from crypto. Okay, so now it's time for me to um, see how much money we do have balanced that will be going, that I will break down for my cash savings and my buffer. So salary is 2,729 and 39p. My full wallet is 527.50 debt payments is 7.62 my subscriptions oh, auto savings 120 I'm trying to skip subscriptions 23.47 and my investment will be 100 pounds so the balance that I will have left for um, my savings is 1,186 and 42p. So this will be for my cash stuffing. I will stuff 1,000 pounds 
and then my buffer that I leave on my account for miscellaneous because no matter how much we plan and we create categories and we think that this is what I'm going to put away money for, life happens and life happens fast. So I always leave a buffer on my account and the buffer that I'm going to be leaving on my account is 186 and 42p, which brings me down to... zero pongs so even though this does not have a dedicated um a dedicated category um i prefer to have a buffer that i know that my account cannot go once it once this amount finishes in my account that's my buffer done that's money done anything else i will have to hop into my emergency funds so i do hope that you enjoyed this video guys and i'll see you in the next one bye